But you didn't think it was an emergency? Well, when I called him back, he would have said, it's an emergency. He said, Mr. Jackson had a bad reaction. I don't know what you resume when you hear that, but when I hear someone had a bad reaction, I don't think anything fatal, me personally. And I wasn't asked to call 911, so he told me what to do, and I did what the doctor instructed me to do, get somebody up there immediately. You, you had, during your conversation, you had a 35-second phone call with Dr. Murray. That's fair, right? 35 yeah. seconds. Yes, sir. And during that whole 35-second phone call, the only thing you heard from Dr. Murray was he had a bad reaction. That's yeah, the only information you got. Wait, everybody is talking over everybody else. The objection is what, please? Mr. Testament. Sustained. It's not testament. I'm asking a question. Just a moment. Uh, again, we're not going to have speaking objections or speaking responses. The objection is sustained. The partial answer is stricken. Please rephrase the question. Are you saying in 35-second conversation with Conrad Murray, the only thing he ever told you about this particular situation was that he had a bad reaction? He told me Mr. Jackson had a bad reaction. He told me to get here right away. And this is excluding my part of the conversation. Mr. Jackson had a bad reaction. Get here right away and to get somebody up here immediately. And I, I tried to follow those instructions to the best of my ability. What is, you, you, you mentioned that you had security on staff 24 hours a day. There was two security at all times on the property. 24 hours a day? Yes, sir. Seven days a week? Yes, sir. Security was very important to Michael Jackson? Yes, sir. Right? It was very important to you on yes. behalf of Michael Jackson, right? Yes, sir. Would you, you have gates that, that close out people from entering the Carrollwood residence, right? Yes, sir. And you have people that, that man those gates? Yes, sir. Security staff? Yes, sir. Right? Um, Entrance into those gates is is guarded and monitored. Yes, sir. If a police officer came into that gate, uh, would they just open the gate? No, sir. If um, a family member came to the gate, would they just open the gate? By Michael's request only. And on, in fact, on May thirteenth, two thousand nine. Uh, you were visited by Joe Jackson and Randy Jackson on that day? The objection is sustained. Mr. Chernoff, let me know for purposes of the noon break uh, when it would be convenient. Well, it's noon. It's going to be a while. So. All right. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to take the noon break. Please remember and comply fully with all of the admonitions and instructions and orders. Um, and uh, please enjoy your lunch. We will be recessed until 1.30 p.m. And if the ladies and gentlemen, the jury could just... Uh, Step down, go into the jury room, and uh, the staff will take care of you afterwards. Thank you. And Mr. Williams, uh, after the jurors leave, you may leave as well. Please don't discuss your testimony of the facts.